crimps on ice. Friday. Today is going to be the best Friday ever. We're going to focus. We're going to do our work super fast. We're just going to get it all done and we're going to have the best day of all time. And then we're going to spend the weekend with the bubas and all the bears because all four bears are in one place and we need to take advantage of that. So I just wanted to say good morning. And then I'm really, really excited for the best day ever because this was not my week. So that means next week will be perfection. We're on a diet. We're each gonna have one ramekin of sauce. Which one are you gonna pick? You can only pick one. And you can't. Oh, I want this one. Your ketchup. But she took it from you. <laughs> no. gonna be a floating hashtag. Shady ASF. Shady as always. ASF. Brandy and Molly left and he was like standing by the door crying and he still keeps going to the door crying and I'm just like bro you got me be happy with your mommy I got more shorts today I'm like so obsessed with bedtime shorts even though I have don't go in the toilet honey even though I have sleep shorts I always just wore like for lack of a better word, I broke out in like hives on my face. It's not gross. Workout shorts. These and uh, excuse the jiggle jabble. I'm really into like. Don't stop, put the, don't stop, put the, put I can't twerk. I edit to make it look like I can twerk. I can twerk a little bit. So what I'm doing now is gonna be kind of weird. Just go with it. I'm giving my room and my apartment a makeover. It's a little bit, just changing some things. Because change is good sometimes, and I was just kind of bored of everything, so. And then I read somewhere it helps like with your mood if you change your bedspread often and change it up. So I just feel like changing it up. I like quilt. I found I'm always hot when I sleep, and I've always had either a comforter or a down comforter. But I've been into quilts lately. The thing I have on my bed now is actually a quilt. And I saw this in JCPenney's, which surprised me because... JC Penney's is not like for old people anymore. I always thought it was an old lady store, but they have cute stuff. So I got this quilt set that just came with a quilt. Well, you guys here. It came with a quilt and two shams. Unfortunately, I don't think it's, I wanted the whole set, so I'm gonna probably have to go online and order some. Sucks, because I wanted everything today, but that's okay. Or maybe I can find just plain, ah, I can find, Plain. I have to see what shams came in there. But I got a new bed skirt because my bed skirt that I have on my bed now is bright as pink. It's actually this color. That's not it, but it's that color. I'm over it. 
but my bed skirt has been wrinkled since I got my bed because I thought the wrinkles would fall out. But I want it to look like grown up and tailored and nice. So I'm gonna take the time to iron it because the wrinkles will not fall out. I hate ironing so much that I'm ironing on my table because I don't even own an ironing board because I don't iron because I'm not about that life. And my iron over here, I don't even have like a legit adult iron. My mom bought me this iron when I went to college because it was on the list of stuff your kid will need. And I was like, why are you even gonna buy me that? I don't need it. But yeah, that iron is probably, I'm not gonna age myself, even though you guys know my age, but I'm just not gonna age myself. It's very old. I don't really have a lot of room and I think he's gonna grab it and run. So I'm gonna just go for it. And Brandy said to do it on the opposite side. Like, I'm not gonna get crazy with it. I just want it to look nice. Hopefully it has enough drop because my bed's raised. I measured the drop so long ago. Honey, they're coming back tomorrow. I promise you. I promise you. Oh my God. You are so freaking spoiled. So spoiled. Hello, can you tell this little spoiled ass nugget that you're coming back tomorrow and Molly's coming back tomorrow and to stop sitting by the door and crying and walking around Aww. crying. He's just walking around. He sounds like a squeak toy. Aww. Tell him that his pee, pee had to fucking dry in the biggest fucking circle because you can't get on 400 North where we got stuck in all that shit. Oh, on did they close 400? Well, they closed the ramp. So how are you supposed to get on the highway? How are you supposed to get on the highway? I had to, I don't know, I had to go all the way around. I went, I had to, I took Roswell Road and went all the way back. You think they would put a sign up that says like, it doesn't work? Yeah, something. I'm sorry, hunty. Cause usually they'll text me stuff like that cause I'm signed up for the Sandy Springs thing. So yeah. if, when they're doing construction and stuff, like some, they'll text me. I see a bubbles. I see a Bentley's under the couch. He's not feeling this mess I made. Okay, so I'm gonna iron it so I don't have to look at wrinkles for three years. Never in my life did I think I would ever iron a bed skirt. Ever. But I guess if I want it to look tailored and nice and not wrinkled forever, it's what I gotta do. Cause I usually just slap them on the bed and call it a night. I am so over it. Like, I've been ironing for 18 years, and now I'm being, like, OCD about it. Like, no wrinkles left behind. Set up is so ratchet. Now for the fun part. I'm gonna have to take the mattress off a bit. Cause my bed is naked. I'm gonna call it a night. I'm exhausted. It's 2 o'clock in the morning. Took me forever to iron it out, and it doesn't even look ironed. So, and the light's making it look brown, but it's not. And I'm gonna put my bed together so I can sleep in it. I'll call it a night. Bye! We all this. Say bye to all your friends. Bye, guys. We're waiting for Auntie Brew to get back. She's out, okay? Bye. Bye!